Good afternoon, everybody. This is Jaron with Collablog back for another quick video. Uh, I wanted to go over a specific use case, uh, tips and tricks kind of thing for, for Zoom. Uh, I had a use case come up where people needed to be able to join meetings, uh, Zoom meetings, and even host. Specifically, they needed to host Zoom meetings, um, but in a situation where they couldn't use video conferencing, such as the app or a PC. Um, in this specific case, because people are driving. Now, I never condone driving distracted. Um, and I certainly didn't want people to uh, be joining meetings distracted. So the solution I came up with kind of uh, works around that. It, it gives them a, either a hands-free or a one-tap solution to join into an audio conference from their phone. Um, so the first thing I'm going to show you is the Zoom personal audio conference. It's an add-on to your Zoom meeting account. Um, once you've added that to your account, uh, to your Zoom meetings account, you get this bar over here uh, on the left-hand side. You see highlighted personal audio conference. Um, you go to that tab in the web portal and you're presented uh, your conference ID, the global dial-in numbers, as well as the host key. And if you look at uh, the global dial-in numbers here, you can add uh, numbers from multiple countries to that. So you have some options there. Your host key, I've set mine to 123654, can't be anything consistent, 1111 or 123456. Um, but you change that through your My Profile. It's the same pin as your, your Zoom Meetings host pin. Um, I'm showing you this just because I, I'm definitely going to change it after this, so I'm not really too concerned about that. Um, but normally it would show up hidden like that. Um, so you get this information for your meetings, and of course you can start it from here, but that doesn't do you a whole lot of good because you just join the Zoom meeting. So what I'm going to show you uh, kind of as the, the tip and trick here uh, is adding it to your phone. So let me switch over to my phone here. Um, here we go. <clears throat> and so you see I already have this little speed dial on my desktop. I'm going to show you what I did here. Um, if I open up my... Settings here, Zoom Audio is a contact that I put into uh, my phone. Now you see this first number is the phone number, 646-518-9805. That's the US, one of the US numbers for Zoom personal audio conferencing. The next, there's a couple of commas here, and I'll explain that in a second. The next number is the conference ID with the hashtag or a pound sign, whatever you want to call that. Then another comma, and then my host pin, 123654-pound. So basically what's happening here is I put this all in as one string, the phone number, comma, comma. What that's doing is it's making a break. So commas are used in uh, a lot of telecom applications to pause it. Um, this does work on both Android and iPhone. I've tested both. Um, so I, I can tell you that it does work in both use cases. Um, <clears throat> and basically what will do, what will happen is if you call this number, uh, it will it'll dial all of this automatically and put you into your meeting. Um, so the great thing about that is you can put a speed dial here or you can use something like Siri or, or Google Voice to, to do it hands-free. Um, but basically, uh, e even if you just do it this way, um, it'll call into your meeting and you really don't have to be fiddling around with your phone while you're driving or, or whatever it is you're doing, you're trying to get to this meeting. So I'm gonna go ahead and demo this and you'll be able to see and hear um, it automatically put in everything uh, and join me into my meeting without ever having to, to mess around with my phone. So let's, let's go ahead and I'm gonna click on it. Welcome to Zoom. Enter your meeting ID followed by pound. So you hear it dialing the number now. If you are the meeting hub, No, you are in the meeting now. As the host, the waiting room has been disabled and the meeting is unlocked. Attendees will be automatically admitted while the meeting is unlocked. You can lock or unlock the meeting by pressing star 5. You are the first participant. Please stand by. So there you heard it. You Please can... press star star to hear the feature menu. Okay, so star star gives you the feature menu. You can lock or unlock the meeting by default. It is unlocked, so you don't have to mess around with your phone. Uh, and this gives you, like I said before, it gives you a quick entry right into uh, your, your meeting. Going back to where you can see me now. Gives you a quick access into your Zoom personal audio conference meeting. You don't have to be messing around with your phone. You can be driving if you absolutely have to. Once again, I'm going to say I do not recommend nor condone uh, 
driving distracted. It is dangerous, um, but I do understand that the, the business case can come up and you actually have to do that sometimes. So there's a quick tri uh, trick <laughs> to be able to do that. Um, I hope you found this useful. If you did, uh, go ahead, comment. If you're on my YouTube channel, go ahead and like and subscribe. Uh, you'll get to see my, my new videos as they come out. Um, as always, check out my blog. It's colla.blog. That's collab blog. Uh, a little nice play on words. So have a good day again. Like and subscribe. Thanks. Let me know what you think.